guys. <laughs> ah, well, it is a match day vlog. And tonight, it is the bother at home to Leeds United. Aye, first home game they've had against Leeds, probably since about um, two games before Covid, if I remember right. They lost 1-0. But of course, by that season, we were close to getting relegated. Obviously today, um, for the bother, um, we're not going to get playoffs, so um, tent is done for us. So obviously the biggest pressure tonight is um, on Leeds. Obviously they're fighting for a place in the top two, um, <coughs> and obviously there's Leicester and Ipswich above them. Um, and Southampton could be on the doorstep. Obviously now the pressure's all on. Um except I think I think that yeah actually. Leicester and Ipswich probably only have two games left. I think Southampton have uh, one or two more than Leeds. Um actually no, it must only be about one actually. Actually if they do have a game and I can't quite think off the top of my head. So yeah, obviously the pressure is on Leeds. So when pressure is on, then obviously it's off for us. On a positive note, pressure's off for us, so we can play more relaxedly. So hopefully Apple bring us a chance to victory. And I'm going to say 2-1 to the bother for tonight, obviously. It's Leeds, so it's the game they want to win the most um, all season. Come on, the bother! <laughs> Oh, 
Well, popped out to the toilet and it's nearly half time. Leeds are now winning 3 2 now. I don't know what, I think this night's going to be an interesting one, I'll tell you. And that's the bloody second ball I've had, what a game. Should have perhaps been disallowed. We've got four minutes left of additional time now to take all three points. Ah uh, well, um when I said win two one, I was being optimistic, but the fact he scored three goals against who were top of the league this late in the season. I was can't I can't complain about that at all. Um I and I'm not even gonna be one of these ones who would say, Oh, we would have won it if them if the ref was better. But thing is, I'm not but I'm still not one who goes blaming refs about um stuff like I I have always said to win the game you've gotta do enough. Which with like including what um mistakes the ref might make. And obviously when it's the first time they've lost for the ages, I'm not gonna start booting off about the fact they've lost. Uh well anyhow guys, thank you all for watching. Please drop a like, subscribe and goodbye.